I'm going to give you three game ideas that you can play with your nativity set or a kid-friendly nativity set with your family. I will leave my favorite kid-friendly nativity set down in the description box below if you need one of those. In this video, I will give you a complete supply list that will be linked in the description box down below, as well as verbal instructions while showing you how to play each of the games. All right, let's get into today's video. Hi, my name is Sean. Welcome to Prayer Lights. I don't know about you, but I have a treasured nativity set I will put in a clip of what my nativity, our nativity set looks like. I wanted to show you a close-up of our nativity set. So follow me. We have the nativity set. Oh, the baby is asleep, so I gotta be really quiet. But I've had this nativity set, the first church I ever served as like a real job, not just an internship. When I left, they gave me this beautiful nativity set. So I want to show it to you. Let me turn you around. All right. There's my son's school project over here, so let me move that out of the way. Here we have, um, this is the willow tree nativity set all set up. And then I've actually got the wise men, okay, ignore the baby pants on the table. <laughs> I've actually got the wise men over here because I'm going to move them around the house and then they won't actually reach the nativity scene until Epiphany Sunday, which is January 6th. All right. Let's get into today's video. The first nativity Christmas party game is called Nativity in a Bag. So what you do is you just get a bag, like this one, and you place a character from your nativity set into the bag. Players have to put their hand in the bag and fill around to figure out which character is in the bag based off of touch and feel. I love simple, quick, easy party games. So that's what you're gonna find here on this channel. Simple, quick, and easy. I'm a mom of two. I don't have time for complicated games. So let's get into game number two. Game number two is called Guess Who Is Missing? And I first saw this game over on Write Ideas with Susan and I will link this game that I have only ever seen her play. I will link her video in the description box down below if you wanna watch a group of kids play this. Basically all you do is you lay out all the characters of your nativity set and then everybody closes their eyes so it's best to play with a group. Everybody closes your eyes. The teacher or the instructor or one person moves one of the characters away and then everybody else has to guess which character is missing. The more pieces you have for this game, the better. I also have a, a long playlist with lots of Christmas party ideas that range from funny and crazy to hilarious to trending. So I will link that playlist in the description box down below for you to watch after this video. Game number three is called Nativity Guess Who. You are going to need either post-it notes or index cards. You're gonna to need to pre-write on the post-it notes or the index cards characters from the Christmas nativity story. So Jesus, Mary, Joseph, sheep, shepherds, wise men, um, King Herod, all of the characters, donkey, um, the inn's keeper. The more people, again, the more people you have, the more fun this is. So you write the characters and assign everybody one and stick it to their back. So stick the character's name to their back. The goal of this game is to figure out what character's on your back. So say I put Mary on the back of mine. I have to go around and ask questions that I can't ask people straight out. So I can't say, am I Mary? Once everybody has figured out what character they are, then the game is over. I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. I look huge in this sweatshirt, but it is the comfiest sweatshirt ever. And it's huge. It goes past my bum. That's how huge the sweater from American Eagle or Aerie. One of those is from.